powers. The world is ours. Me and my brother twin like the towers, and we want it now. Wow, welcome back to the channel, guys and girls. We are almost to the lake of the Winnipesaukee's. Uh, we're gonna go for lake trout today. We have severe dropping pressure. We have a, a rainstorm coming in this afternoon. Uh, so it's 6.57 in the morning and it's January 3rd or 4th or something like that. January 3rd. So, going for lake trout. I packed light today. Um, only sonar, the sled, some snacks, and camera gear. That's it. And a couple of uh, circle tackle rods and the Winnie kit. So, we're gonna go for um, the Lakers and White Perch, if we can get them. We're gonna be standing on some, some thin ice, so be wearing all my safety gear, of course. Let's go! I do have a spot out here that I've caught fishing before. So we're gonna kinda go there first. Well, looks like people are fishing right here. Which is good, I have no idea how much ice there is, but Seems like there's enough. Probably because I felt mistreated. Bad enough, I don't hear excuses. Trust me, you could keep it. Saw it coming from a mile away once I peeped it. Caught up in that drama, mama. I don't give a And we had freezing temps where I was last night. Or where I live. We gained probably another three eighths of an inch last night. Which is good. Now let's just do a hole here, see what it looks like. Oh, we got a laker down there already. See if he or she is willing to play. All my stuff's frozen. Yeah, that could be a laker, it's not moving. Dang. Uh, a big suspended fish just came in. That's good that we saw life already. I and mean, it should be above freezing for most of the day today. It's supposed to get some rain, but definitely a rainbow that came in a minute ago. It was super high up. Rainbow or salmon, actually, where I am. It's melt all around me. Something will be coming by soon. And I'm the only one out here. The one and only. And we're basically looking for basin fish here. <sighs> My fishing reel is frozen. This is older braid, so the uh, coating is kind of worn off on it, which makes it slightly waterproof. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Killing these cats with they facilities, flush down the drain. All eight lives too, that become a centerpiece. Fold and be a masterpiece and half of all our faculties. We actually don't, we just don't know that half of we. Nothing 110 feet around me. Not good. Not good. Let's reel up and go somewhere else. Huge school of smell. They just got chased. Oh no, where'd they go? They legit just disappeared. I don't know where that school was smelt went to, but they were being chased. Oh yeah, there's some Lakers right there. That is so cool. So that's a lake trout chasing, chasing smelt. See them? That's so freaking cool. Oh, right there. Right there, come on. Rainbows. Rainbow. Oh, no, Laker. Yes. Yes, first Winnipesaukee Lake Trout of the year. Uh, this Laker came in high suspended, super skinny though, but we're going to put him right back down. Show him to the camera, such a pretty fish, pretty, pretty fish. 
All right, and he had another one with him too, so. And I just saw um, a bunch of smelt getting chased on the uh, live scope there. Oh, there's one down there right now. I could have sworn that was gonna be a rainbow. Oh, here it comes screaming for it. Screaming. Oh, he didn't like that. Oh, here comes another one. Oh, there's three lake trout on me. Oh, no, no, no. I pulled down my tail. There's three lake trout down there. Come on. You better be recording. Oh. He wants it. I could probably see him. I'm gonna, there's four lake trout down there. This is insane, guys. Frick, they're, they're nipping it, they're nipping it. So what we're gonna do, quickly, is bite it and stub it. I'm shaking, I'm shaking, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. But there's Lakers down there. 100%, move you back over here a little bit. Oh man. That was crazy. There was three hot on me there for a while. Some came in suspended, which was crazy. Oh, got the blood going. Got that heart pumping, guys. And uh, we are on this much ice. Not sure how much that is. I don't have my tape measure. I have it somewhere with me, but those Lakers aren't far. I'm hoping. We get a high suspended mark over here. We're gonna raise up. He's at the 65 feet or so. There's the wall of smelt. Right at the 60, and they're getting chased still. That's why those fish are coming in suspended. Yeah, those, there's gotta be Lakers like right in the midst of those because they just went from a column being squished right to the bottom. There's one right there. He's 60 feet behind me. We seem to be behind me quite a bit. That's okay. I can move out. Well, that was sweet. 100% sure that was a rainbow because it came in so high and it came in as a pair. And uh, sure enough, there's a lake trout. So let's go uh, find some more. I'm gonna pop that sonar down while I'm here one last time to see if. I mean, in that short period of time, the smelt has come back. Oh, there is a liquor down there. There is a liquor down there. Come on. Get down there. Come on. Just came and snubbed me. Oof. There must be pennies down there. So if all else fails and they're being really finicky, this is what I switch to. Literally the only other thing that I'll do besides use my own baits. I really should be making something that size for you guys, but uh, I haven't done it yet. Yes, it really depends on if they're on pin smelt, which is like the, the fry of uh, this year's, or the springs, I guess, if you want to call it that, smelt. So tiny, tiny, tiny. Smaller than the one I got on now, so it's something a little too bright, I guess. But we're just gonna drop down that jig one more time. There appears to be bait in the area that just keeps cycling in and out. It's probably just getting chased, but 
Here comes two. So there's one, one low and one high, 50 feet behind me. Let's go drill out there. We can always come back here, obviously. That's what I want to do. I don't know if I marked. But we want to go 50 feet. So uh, one, two, four. And we're going to make some noise. Make some noise. Oh. What the hell is that? Very spooky. Very spooky fish. Came in, looked at it, and darted right away. But there he goes, he's at the 30 and the 40. I'm not seeing any bait or fish. I'm literally staring at my hole, I could see it. So they're not over there. Well, before it starts pouring rain out, um, I'm gonna do an outro. So thank you guys very much for watching just that one Laker, but that's okay. That's what happens when we have diving down pressure. The, pre the fishing's good like for a very short window and then it slows down, but there is lots of smelt in uh, the area that I am in, in today. So I think I'm gonna come back maybe Thursday or maybe Friday or something like that when the pressure's a little bit better and hopefully this rain doesn't kill the ice. But if you wanna get your baits that I've been using in the video below, uh, you can visit uh, bennettfishing.company.site. The link for that is below, along with the rod is from Circle Tackle, and um, all the, the pistol bit and all the Eskimo stuff. All, the, all that stuff is linked below, as you may know, but it's kind of, they've hit it on YouTube, so you gotta like find it real quick. Thanks for watching.